Which means the winner is Richard. Let's see it again. Richard, you've won for Richard. Hi, Richard. Hello. How happy are you? You've won a TV and DVD player. <laughs> oh, very happy, thank you. <laughs> was that one of the funniest things you've seen in a long time? Oh, brilliant, that. <laughs> would you like to say thank you to other Richard? TV and DVD. Uh, now, while we all recover and certainly Richard recovers, we're going to go for a break. Stop See you in a moment. Yeah. 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 Richard yeah. 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 there. Welcome back to Big Breakfast and Patrick Keelty. Oh, well, uh, and I'm Lisa Rogers, and wasn't that worth getting out of bed for? Oh. Yeah. You yes. are a legend in our own Starton. Starton! Now it's time to hook up with our man who always has an outside chance. It's Mike McLean. We ask, where are you? Squeaky! Yay! Yay! The jack of diamonds, eh? <laughs> hey, One come on, of the ears of clubs. <laughs> there you go. Come on, Fantastic. Yeah. Now, uh, that was... Uh, do you think you'd really hear the ear kind of similar? I don't think so. I think, um, let me, uh, may, may I ask? Yes. If I was Mike go McLean, on. I'd slap it now. Ah, there you go. There, just like that there. Right. Yes, I knew that was coming. Now, one morning, we've given you the chance to vote for simply the best. The contender, which you'd like to receive some hero worship later on the show. You yes, get to choose who it is. The choices are... Oh, oh, it's all yeah. changed so, so quickly here uh, this morning uh, on The Big Breakfast. So if you want to influ influence those percentages, get on the phone and p cast your votes. That's yes, what I'm saying. all of that sort of stuff. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I've been told to apologise uh, for saying... Uh, I meant to say ass instead of the A or S. Apparently that's a swear word at this time of the morning. There you go. Mm. Uh, uh, what I said about my backside. Yeah, says that now. Okay, hey. <laughs> uh, 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 in a moment, it's the cool of Christendom. It's Samuel L. Jackson in the house. Yeah. Right yeah. Two of our favourite yeah. stand sounds, yes. we bring you Two's Up. Yes. Yes. It is a big breakfast. Uh, it's time now for a big guest. Yesterday, of course, we had Roseanne on the show. Mm -hmm, uh, we did. Today, I think we've gone one better case because we have. this is something, or should I say someone rather special, an old friend of the show. Yeah, he is possibly the coolest man in Christendom. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. Can, can, you, can you guess who it is? Yeah! yeah. 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 Hello. Welcome to the show. How are you? Hey, I'm great. Yeah. 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 We love you. Yeah, pleased to be in England. Oh, yeah, always. Yeah. It's always yeah. a great, great time to come back here. It's always good to be on this show. I think before, when I was yeah. judging something up there. You're not Johnny. I'm not Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If you want me to be Johnny, I definitely could be. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. So you intend to promote Shaft, your new film? I can't say Shaft. It sounds wrong. I say Shaft. British, can you? Yeah, you need to be a movie, Shaft. <laughs> How's Shaft been for you? A fun film. Uh, it's one of those um, big summer movies in the U.S. Full on. Yeah, yeah, so it's like a gun movie. Yeah. Okay. Pulling guns, yeah. a lot That's of fighting. Like. Um, now, we had Roseanne Barr on the show yesterday, and she blessed into a little secret. Lovely lady. That you uh, purchased her house. Well, yeah, it's uh, a tidy little sum. Yeah. Have, have you moved in yet? Uh, actually... <laughs> oh, what do you think? Um, I'm, um, my wife, um... <laughs> very, very diplomatic there. Yeah. Very so, diplomatic. So, that, that was the house a wee bit trashy, was it? No, no, the house is fine, you know. From, from what I understand, Ian Fleming modeled James Bond. There you go. Yeah, Goldfinger, no, because he, he built uh, Trellick Tower yeah. as well. Oh, architectural oh, yeah. the, the, anyway. the James Bond architect. Just, just a trough of information. Oh, that's it. Yeah, yeah I, I, Roseanne did a little message for you, and I think we should go straight on to yeah. that. Yes. Yes. Well, this is her yesterday. <laughs> I can't wait to run across those in whatever nook and cranny she left them. Uh, there you go. Uh, are you going to be nipping in I, to borrow some shit? Yeah. 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 And you can hang with magic. Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly. right. All right, yeah. works for me. Samuel is going to be with us all morning, so if you so much as move or breathe, then you're going to have him to answer to. Because he's a man! Oh, yeah. uh, welcome back. It is the big breakfast. It's the 31st of August. I'm Patrick Keelty. Yeah. Yes, it is. And I'm Lisa Rogers. Yeah. Still to come on this morning's show. Yes, indeed. After the new. R&B sensation Samantha Bumba, she's here. Good. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And also, oh, another.
another honey. Richard Bacon, he's going to be getting the lowdown from EastEnders in oh, Spain. Richie. Yes, Richie, Richie, Rich. Richie. But now it's but, over to Gemma Woodman with the big breakfast news and weather. Thank you very much, Gemma. No, uh, Gemma's all... not horrid. Gemma's lovely, but no. Patrick was just showing me his clicking jaw, and that's horrid. There you go. Nasty. nasty. Some nasty yeah. stuff. Uh, all morning you've been voting for the person that you think is simply the best, where you decide who wins the coveted title. It's all up for grabs this morning, folks. Yes. The had... house oh, is building God. to a crescendo. You had the choice of three entrants. You've made your decision. You've all phoned and voted. If you haven't voted yet, you're too late. Full lines are closed. The votes have been counted. The winner could have been Vegetable Gras, Peter... The champion porridge maker, Scott Chance. Oh. But with... La -la -la -la, 51 votes. <laughs> Yes, indeed, Mark. We are not going to ask you to step through the curtains because you're not just good. You're not merely very good, but you are. You're simply the best. Yeah. Right, if your if your mum was Bart Simpson, you would use it against her, wouldn't you? I just would. got to. Fantastic. I have to say, it is a star. It is the Simpsons. Uh, in the house this morning, we have just got too much sex. We got Richard Furbrass in the house. We have. Yeah. Yeah. A little bit later on, and also Samantha Mumba. Yes, this is Channel Four. You're watching The Big Breakfast, where a major star every day is simply part of the course. Yes, uh, uh, that's a private joke between the crew. Obviously, people at home haven't seen uh, his backside, but it's damn fine. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's, 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 is it big? Yeah. 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 Okay, oh, for us, uh, still to come this morning, we have got more from Samuel L. Jackson. Yeah. Yeah. Him, how lucky am I? Oh. And uh, let's have a little peek at what else we've got coming up. Yes. Here he is. Yes. Here he is. Every day that you find yourself in the presence of pure. Welcome to the big breakfast. Introduce a new video. Oh, oh. no. Yes. Here it is. We're looking at the, possibly the winner of next year's room of the year. <laughs> okay, now, when, when word got around the office that you were coming on the show, all the people in the office said that they did. Um, and unfortunately, they couldn't actually make it down to the show. to do was to get a little video camera and, uh, and take the questions. Oh, yeah. It's from Anna, and okay. Anna's an assistant producer. Ooh. Personal approval. Oh, did he? Um, so he thinks it's pretty cool, which is a big. Oh. Massively showing my age. Oh, I do love him. I got Stardust, you know, with all the hair and the yeah. <laughs> bit thing down the face. Yeah, maybe not. Okay, the next question is uh, from Patrick, who's one of the runners. I mean, obviously, I'm almost old enough to be his mother. But drink on Tuesday, <laughs> Wednesday, mm -mm. Thursday, she was washing me pants. Friday, we had to row and kick the cat, you know. He's, he's a really sexy boy. Oh, you're kind of tight then. I like extenders or something. Yeah. <laughs> okay, next up, we've got uh, Carol, who works in accounts. He's cutie. He's really cutie. It's definitely on the mother. <laughs> okay, uh, next question is from Chrissy, who looks after the big breakfast props. Chrissy! Oh, Chrissy, look a bit early, because you've been travelling all over the all yeah, UK. Okay. You're home and always will be. Definitely. And you're always going to be a home girl from Dublin. Yeah. Uh, bought up half the flats on the lip <laughs> uh, Next question is from our tea lady, June. Okay. Now, that was the kind of answer. I was expecting you, your PR in your ear going, don't, you're not 18 yet, don't say vodka. That's all right. Yeah, okay. Don't worry. And but you, could you eat whatever you want? Yeah, pretty much. Burgers, fries, like that. Okay. <laughs> um, dash, dash. Next up, uh, we've got uh, Simon and Martin from our forward planning department. Okay. Oh, look at them. They're, they're a bit rough. You might quite want to do that. Fair play. It was more fashion shoot than anything. Like the whole kind of being, being. <laughs> we have, we have got, well, I mean, especially the video, the body to body video. I mean, looking sexy. Do we not conscious decision to go for the kind of... Hey, I want you just to show that dance move from your first yeah. video with the pole because there's nothing sexier than that. You know, it's like you're holding a Sorry? pole and doing that. <laughs> okay. Come on, because it's my favourite... It's my favourite dance move in a, in a video this well, year. Yeah. And you bend the legs. Yeah. And you move... <laughs> there you go.
Oh, baby. Uh, but first, it's over to the... First, it's over to the Costell Walford, Richard Bacon, tracks down East Enders in Spain. Yeah. On the planet, it is Samuel L. Jackson. Yeah. Right now, I just feel smug. Welcome to my boudoir. Thank you. So nice to be here. Ah, oh, it's lovely to have you. Now, in Shaft, you are looking very foxy, Thank I you. might say. Hollywood producers, what can you do? You get promise sex and they They just don't deliver. They promised me sex this morning too. Did they? <laughs> and did they deliver? <laughs> Busy for a moment, and while you look at a kip of shaft. Oh yes. <laughs> now, um, I, I understand the uh, the long leather coat and uh, the ca the uh, glasses thing is now sort of catwalk chic. Yeah. After <laughs> <laughs> the house like that. Uh, you you in the black leather coat and the uh, the shades. Mm -hmm. Catwalk chic. Mm -hmm. We're doing that, and a few footballers as well wearing long leather coats. How does your daughter feel about you being a? Sends me on missions, and she actually trusts me now to actually pick out things that she'll like. And uh, I'm, I'm doing is uh, his hair because you're bald. You yeah, know, bald, bald men yeah, are sexy. Yeah. Yeah. Into the role that you're playing because it changes you Sometimes. physically. Okay. <laughs> well, we've got some wigs here for you to try on, and I want you to, to tell me how do you, who do you feel that you're like when you put these on. This one is kind of Beckham before the shaved head, so if you'd like to just kind of getting wiggy with it, improvising. Only man who still looks cool in a blonde mullet. Okay, so who's the role? Who do you think you are? Do you think you're a criminal? I was really quite taken with you, you know? It, it's, it's, it's such a wonderful thing to be here with you in your boudoir. Oh, that's it. It's a posh, heavy rocker. Oh, yeah. yeah! Fantastic! Next wig! Now, this kind of reminds me of Black Lace, I have to say, who sang Agadu. Oh, that, <laughs> that top, top tune in the 80s. Stick the wig on. <laughs> We're in your bed. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's that Emin.
final wig. Now, Deborah, our producer, said I look like Michelle Pfeiffer in this, so obviously my ego is huge. Um, so let's yeah. give it up. Yeah. Who's oh. Channel 4? You're watching The Big Breakfast. Yeah. She's just about recovered from Samuel L. Jackson. Welcome back to the Big yeah. Breakfast, folks. You okay? I'm never going to be the same again. Good. <laughs> right. Mike McLean, however, squeaky himself, has been out all day in Ipswich checking out people's rears. Checking the booty. Hey. Oh. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks, squeaky. That was fantastic. A legend in his own life. Yeah. Do you know? Uh, I think it's time. It's time we got. Isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. It's been a rip run two hours this morning. It's time to thank all the guests this morning. First of all, Samuel L. Jackson. He's Yay! had to go. But he's changed my life he's forever. Off, but he's a star. Oh, yeah. Samantha Mumba, simply the, yeah. simply the best contenders champion, porridge mix. Yes. And uh, our ticket to high Pass holder, Jake Blues. Mr. Blues. And of course, Richard Fairbrass with the funniest. Ten. In his own lunchtime. But now, folks, it's time to go over to Gemma Woodman for the last time. Big breakfast news and weather. Thanks, That's Jim. We will see you. There yeah. she is. What are you Gemma. up to tomorrow? What are you up to today, rather? Oh, she's gone. Oh, Bye. there you go. She's gone. Okay, uh, coming up on tomorrow's Big Breakfast, we've got Emily Fox and Frank Harper, who are starring in a new drama called Other People's Children. We have WCW legend yeah. Goldberg. He's here. Yeah. We love him. We've got Mel B dishing the dirt on her ex-husband. Jimmy Gulsar. Yeah, we, we hope. want to know We've also got about. Plum of the Week. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it is Friday. Oh, don't miss it. But you're watching The Big Breakfast. She's Lisa Rogers. I'm Patrick Kildee. We will see you tomorrow. Good luck. Yeah. Goodbye. Yeah.